Hey guys, it's your girl, Lasha Stoney XO. I have a super fun video today. I'm just, I've been waiting to do this. I've ha actually had these um, for about a week now, and I just have not had the time to film this video, so I'm super stoked. But I am going to do a swatch video for these gorgeous Urban Decay Vice lipsticks. Um, now, some of these are mattes. It will tell you. Um, the, this one right here says, um, there, this one's a metallic. Um, this one right here's a metallic. So, they have different formulas. Um, this one is a metallic. I didn't know I got so many metallics. Um, this one is a cream. Um, this one is a matte. And this one is a cream. So, I got one matte, two creams, and three metallics. Now, every, I've been to two, um, so not supports, two, um, Ulta's. And they've sold out of this color at both Ulta's. So, I think this particular color is so wearable that it sells out like that. So, if you're interested in this color when I swatch it, you need to go and get you one of these. They're $17. This one right here, I don't know if you can see it. Probably not. It is called Back Talk, and it is a matte color, and it's probably... I haven't tried the other ones, but this one right here is so freaking beautiful for an everyday just throw on color. It's so natural and pretty. I love the bullet style, very sexy and sleek style lipstick container. And it says, obviously it says Urban Decay on it. You pull the top off. And there is your gorgeous color. Now, again, this one, like I said, is the most um, popular lip colors. So, I was even thinking about going back and getting me a backup of this one because I love it so damn much that this is like my everyday lipstick and I do not want to run out. And again, this one is in Back Talk. And it is a matte. Okay, so I'm going to swatch. I'm going to do a swatch of my arm for each color. So let's start with the back talk. And it is a matte. Now I will say this is not a drying matte. It is a very moisturizing matte. So what I do when I... I'll fix and put it on without the top. What I like to do when I do use this matte color... There it is right there. Is that not a gorgeous everyday color? Hello. I got to go get me a backup. Um, again, this one is called Back Talk. It's super popular. Um, and it's $17. And what I like to do to make it super matte, I will use the Smashbox. Um, that little mattifying tube that you put over lipsticks. And I will just put a dab over this and it will make it completely matte. But if you don't like a complete matte look, you don't like a drying look, you like more of a creamy one, this matte is super creamy. It even says on the box, Com comfortable matte. So that tells you right there that it's not a dry formula at all. It's very popular, like I said. Beautiful, one of my favorites. Okay, the next one um, is called Violet, and it is a cream. You can see that? Probably not. So, this is called Violet, and it is a cream lipstick. And, again, they all have the names on the bottom. So, if you have a container, a lipstick container, where you can set them... This way, I would recommend doing that, and then you can see all the names like that. Because I think that's pretty cool. It shows the color and the name. So, this is Violet. And this is another gorgeous, like, everyday color. Because, you know what I did the other day? I, um, I meant to get Back Talk. 
and because I was in a hurry and I ran, to run out the door just for like an everyday lipstick. So I I thought I was putting back talk on, but I accidentally put violet on, and so they're not that different. But the back talk is a little more mauve, and this one is more pink. So I'm gonna swatch it. I don't want it to break, so I'm gonna roll it down just a tad. So I'm gonna swatch it beside the back talk, and you will see how similar the colors are. This one is violet, and it's a cream. This one is back talk, and it is a matte. So like I said, I just grabbed this one because I thought that it was back talk, but I got compliments on this one, so hey. Let me see what they smell like. I didn't even smell them. I can't smell anything, to be honest. I was smelling my perfume for a minute. I was like, dang, they smell good. That was my perfume, so sorry. They do not have a smell at all. Um, so that was Violet. Okay, the next one we're going to try. Let's see, what is this one? The other cream we have is Raven's Wood. Raven's Wood. And the reason why I bought this one is the girl that was working at Urban Decay, the counter, was wearing this one. And I said, what color do you have on? And she said, this color. And I was like, sign me up, girlfriend. I want it. I want it. So she showed me where it was. And I naturally, I had to have it. Um, so I have not tried it on myself. She does have dark hair and dark skin and dark eyes. She's very beautiful. But look how this one looks like a very wearable color also. I think all these colors, that I, the first three that I'm showing you are very like everyday wearable colors. And the other three are more adventurous. See with... Um, Ravenswood it is definitely darker and it has more of a mauve color back talk is a mauve but with a pinkish tone and violet is definitely a pink so there you go to show you the different colors now we're going to get into the metallics which I'm super excited to try these because I have not tried the metallics but um, I was watching a video, um, and I saw somebody using the metallics, and they looked beautiful. So, I'm super excited to try them. Um, this one is called Amulet, and it is the metallic one. This is right here, Amulet. Um, if you can, as you can tell, I like mauve colors, so... I don't get too too much out of my comfort zone, but this, I mean, the metallic ones are a little bit out of my comfort zone. Now, this one is a lot darker, but it still has that mauve tone to it. Um, it's more of a brownie, maybe the color I'm wearing now, more of a brownie um, mauve color. Let's see. Let's swatch it and see. We will swatch this bad boy and we'll check it out. Okay. So... I should, I should have done it the other way because it's not, okay. Now, as you can see right here, it is similar to the color I'm wearing, but the color I'm wearing is a matte, and this one is a metallic, so it's got a more creamy, shimmery um, tone to it, and it is a brown, more like 90s grunge color with a little bit of shimmer to it so i think it's gorgeous i think it would be a great everyday color um yeah and you can even if you wanted to you could throw on one of those uh the smashbox matte thing the lip thing and i guarantee you can matte this up I, I, you can matte anything up basically um so that is a gorgeous color again this one is called um the amulet and it's the metallic one so there we go again we have back talk violet rose wood no no ravenwood is it ravenwood let me make sure ravens wood is this color right here 
and this color right here what i said it was called i have a bad memory y'all um amulet 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 okay the next color we're gonna try conspiracy oh i heard some really good things about this color um let's see what it looks like and if it does anything for me i don't know this is conspiracy i'm super excited to try this one of course you got your little bullet tube and then you've got your name and color that's what i said if you had a container to put all these in that would be so pretty because you could see all the colors okay this one is conspiracy look how dark and shimmery it's got a gorgeous tone to that do you see that oh, it's so pretty okay so let's swatch this one right by the other metallic oh, it's so pretty so pretty so there we go conspiracy very like a 90s grunge color kind of like well no mine's more mauve this one's a little more darker than what i'm used to but i wanted to get out of my comfort zone and try a out there color i found a purple a bright purple but i couldn't find um they have so many colors i just couldn't find it i might go back and get it i don't know but this one's cool because it's out of my comfort zone it's a very dark shimmery well they're calling it metallic the last one i got is called trick and it's metallic the reason why i got trick is because i was told by one of my friends that works at ulta that it is a lipstick that can transform any lipstick so it looks like this and you're probably thinking that looks like nothing okay it looks like this but once you put it over a color let me see what, I, what color i should put it over hmm i'm gonna get i think right uh i always call it rosewood it's raven's wood i'm gonna put i'm gonna swatch this one again and i'm gonna show you that this color right here trick which is metallic, will transform any lipstick that you buy. So, this one, again, is Raven's Wood. And I'm going to swatch it on my hand this time. More of a larger swatch. Good. Okay, so now I'm going to use Trick, which is a metallic. And I'm going to go over it. And it is supposed to transform the color so as you can see it's made it a whole lot shimmery lighter it just really made it pop like here it is right here there it is right there without any trick on it and then when you add the trick it just gives it this gorgeous almost like a highlighter effect so it transforms any lipstick like i could put it on right now and i had some bling bling but i'm fixing to go somewhere so i'm just gonna leave my makeup like it is before i mess it up um but i hope you enjoy this lip uh swatch video of the brand new urban decay vice lipsticks you need to go try them out they have some amaze bomb colors i'm wanting to get some purples just to get out of my comfort zone but i did get a lot of pretty pretty everyday colors and then a couple of colors like this one that is not going to um that is out of my comfort zone and i forgot to swatch trick for you guys so let me go ahead and swatch trick i don't know if trick is going to show up just because it is um more of a highlighter yeah it's not showing up it is more of a highlighter lipstick right here if you can see so yeah that's why she was telling me it is a great one just to have in case you want to change 
whatever lipstick you're wearing or maybe you want to just dab a little bit in the center of your lip for a pouty lip you can do so much with trick trick i think i think you should get like maybe a color and then get trick and you'll have two very versatile colors to play with but yeah so i really really love this collection i plan on getting more if i get more i will do some more swatches for you guys and i hope you enjoy this swatch video if you did Please give this video a big thumbs up and comment below. Tell me what your favorite color is and if you've tried the Urban Decay Vice colors. And if so, what color would you recommend me buying? Because I'm always looking for a new lipstick. I just want to say I love you guys to pieces and thank you for watching. And have a good one, guys. Love you. Bye, guys.